Hey, I'm Liam from QIS Packaging, and in this video, I'm going to take you through the South Australia plastics ban. In 2009, South Australia led the way by introducing a statewide ban on lightweight plastic bags that were 35 micrometers thick or less. However, this did not include biodegradable bags. Building on this, South Australia's Waste and Avoidance Act of 2020 aims to reduce litter and pollution in our ecosystems in two phases. From March 1st, 2021, single-use plastic straws, stirrers and cutlery are all prohibited from sale and distribution in South Australia, as well as their bioplastic alternatives. However, these items can be replaced with reusable, plastic-free, compostable alternatives. Then, from March 1st, 2022, South Australia will also prohibit the sale and distribution of expanded polystyrene cups, bowls, plates and plastic clamshells. Oxo-degradable plastic products will also be banned from sale, as they are made with an additive that just breaks them down into tiny particles called microplastics, but it does not actually decompose them. Under the new rules, an individual found to be selling or distributing banned single-use plastics can face a fine of between $315 and $1,000 depending on severity. For extreme breaches, a maximum penalty of $20,000 can be applied. Exemptions are allowed for the sale and distribution of plastic straws and spoons for people who have disabilities or medical needs until 1st of March 2022. The legislation also allows for the exemptions of single-use plastic straws by prescribed businesses, such as pharmacies, local government agencies, charities, and medical and dental clinics. You might be wondering about the COVID risk of switching to reusable items. However, the current health advice recommends using reusable cutlery, glass or ceramic items if there's sufficient cleaning. For more information about the plastics ban in your state, check the links in the description below. 